Yeah, yeah, good day, good day, guys, good day, guys. Um, this is Synthetic Death on uh, Instagram and uh, on Telegram. We have a channel on Telegram, and I want to make this video tutorial about a uh, scalping strategy that is working. Okay, uh, a scalping strategy that is working. I've been using it. Um, for the past five years now and it's working I assure you it's still working that is what I've been using um, some time ago I shared this on telegram but uh, it was not all that useful so uh, I have to make um, another um, strategy that it will best fit Oh, uh, the first one that I did, what, what that was the five years ago, it was working, but um, due to um, the levels, it was a little bit deceiving if you have not yet mastered it. But with these levels, it's working, it's working. So first, what you're going to need is um, you just go on your MT5 platform. And we are using one minute and it's usually doing the scalping of boom and crash that is the boom thousand boom 500 and uh, crash thousand crash 500 years so we are working on one minute time frame so our settings what we do um, you just go to your indicators um, for charts then you go and select your RSI that is the RSI, yeah, the Relative Strength Index. So I'll just go. I have inserted it already, so you just follow me with the steps. So you just go on your indicators, and there's my indicator window two. That is, and the one is for other purpose. So we are using indicator window two. So you go to Relative Strength Index. Your period should be 14. You apply to close. Your levels 80, 20, 10. Um, 90 and 50 um, then you choose a color of your choice and I'm using green then you click on done then on the, on the same the indicator in the two you are going to insert relative strength index again and this time you are going to clear the levels because you have already um, insert the levels so you clear the levels then your period should be 6 you apply to close then here you change the color then the pixel I'm using two pixel for each then the color is red so that is what you see here then the last thing to do is to insert your MACD the MACD we have 12 to 69 that is the default settings for MACD then um, for the main if your background is white you make it white because we don't need it um, if it's black you make it black because we don't need it we only need the signal so in order to differentiate between the colors of the uh, SRI 14 and the 6 the signal I make it red color and the same pixel 2 I'm using 2 pixel for each of them for clarification if your two pixel is not enough clear for you make it three pixel there are some phones if you make it one you don't see anything two you're not going to see anything but three four you make it a little bit clear but don't make it too loudy in order for you to make it contradicted so i'll just um pixel two then i'm done if i'm done that is what you see you see these are the levels that um, we choose for the SRI 14 so my SRI 14 is the green then the 6 is the red and the MACD is the short dashes line that you see there to differentiate it now how are you going to use this strategy we are going to use a crossover every crossover is a crossover but mind you hey there are some spikes you, are make, you, you should know that we are making a scalping train okay so definitely there will be a crash so how will I avoid this crash in order not to lose some money? One, you have to check in your levels. Where they are intersecting. Are they on my level 20? On the level 10? 
are they on my that is for crash okay for crash you are looking out for a crossover on the level 10 and the level 20 so have this condition mate if no then you have to wait there are some crash it will go um above a crossover like this um let me show you something here a crossover like this you see a crossover like this it's a crossover but it's not on level 10 it's not on level 20 if you have mastered this um, strategy for some time you're able to know where to enter even though it's not on your it's not a crossover on the level 20 or 10 but as a new beginner and you're beginning to use this strategy i urge you you use your levels wisely so so what do you do you just wait for this crossover to happen on the level 20 or level 10 so this is a perfect crossover here this is a perfect crossover oh sorry as you can see this is a perfect crossover here it crosses on level 20 now you see the gap between the MACD and the uh, SRI 14 then 6 you see it is very small some passes through in the intersection is is very um what do you call it it's complete okay the MACD will com make intersection complete with the SRI 14 then 6 but this one you see if you study it well you see there is a small gap inside it's telling you it's perfect there are some that makes um, the MACD will crawl they will cross over but there's a little uh, wider space in it for that if you're a new beginner you just ignore it because there are more opportunities in the market and it's not just uh, this one that is going to deceive you to for spike to catch you just wait and study it very well so what do we do this is a perfect crossover you take a maximum of five candles you are out maximum of five candles you are out now we move to you see this is what i was talking of this is what i was talking of a perfect one here this is what i was talking of you see uh, under this arrow the magd what crosses the lsi 14 then 6 but look hey look at the gap you see there is a gap over there and it's not even yet on your level 20 so what do you do you just ignore it because a spike can happen at any time but if you're good at support and resistance uh, you can study it on a higher time frame of uh, five, let's say 15 to 30 minutes time frame so as it crashed to a certain level that is your support if it has crashed to uh, the support and it's now trending up hey this you can take a maximum of 10 candles because it was it has already hit on your support level and it's training up so but if you don't know anything about it just use this strategy for scalping you just ignore it this is another perfect crossover it was yet on um, very small to reach our level 20 you can take it and one more secret about this strategy is um wait thousand indices they trend for a longer time and they spike huge so whenever crash thousand like this crashed bigger too hey it will perfectly meet your condition you take a maximum of five to ten candles you are out you see this it was a huge crash and now it, it meets our conditions over here all this you ignore this this is a, a crossover that is has a huge um, space and it was on level 50 hey we don't need it there is another crossover but i see it was small small crash and it's not on level 20 you can ignore it we need a perfect one okay um, let's move on 
yes that is what i was expecting now as i was saying crash thousand crashed for um sorry trend for a long time then crashed bigger now whenever um crash thousand is crashing small small downwards please wait for the market to settle okay don't enter any crossover once there is a small small crash with crash thousand no 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 don't enter just wait for the market to settle you see from here it crashes small 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 you see where it um, it intersects over here it intersects another one over here but look at the sr14 the sr14 then six do not intersect with the macd over here so even this is telling you that there is not a perfect crossover you just leave it then you move on once you see a crash that is stronger too it will definitely meet our condition then we take in a trade something like this you see when the crossover is perfect this is a perfect crossover that i'm talking of this is a perfect crossover the sr14 then 6 the macd intersect in the same line and it's on level 20 perfect there is no way spike will catch you on this there is no way spike will catch you on this this is another strategy this is another um uh, perfect condition but there was a small small crash as i was telling you to avoid it but here it's a complete um then a complete intersection so you can take a maximum of five then you are out let's move to another indices in the crisis boom thousand boom thousand you are taking a level of level 80 then level 90 with the same strategy that i was saying when the the macd crosses sr14 then six uh, it's on level 80 perfect we take a maximum of five to ten candles you're out maximum should be five but if there is a perfect crossover like this you can take more than five then you're out there's another perfect crossover here you see it it intersects perfectly with on level 80 no spike will catch you. you just finish your five to ten candles before any spike will happen by that time you've already eaten the other time you've already eaten there is another crossover here there is another perfect crossover here take a maximum of five to ten candles you are out so let's move to crash five the 500 indices with crash 500 is um crash crash 500 and then boom 500 are something like they don't trend for long they've been crashing unexpectedly the moment you see there is a small crash the moment you see there is a crash it turn to trend for some time then a crash they normally crash anyhow so with this strategy um i urge you be careful on the 500 indices and i will not lie to you um we don't lie we don't lie i personally don't lie and I have to tell you the truth because you have, you have to know with 500 indices they crash anyhow and with this strategy you should be careful although there will be a crossover that you can take a maximum of five candles but hey when there is a small small spike you avoid it but when there is a huge spike like two at the same time which meets your condition hey it just take a maximum of five candles you're out look at this look at this crashing small 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 making a cross over here by the time you realize spike have already catch you but with a thousand indices they are work it's working perfectly now look at this here you can take some candles there it's a perfect match over here this is another perfect match in this you see whenever there is a small small crash please you just avoid it the 500 indices i don't trust them with this strategy but you can use it if you master it very well you can use it so um you just learn the strategy that i've taught you and how you are going to use it it's very easy 
it's very easy guys it's very easy you can make money out of this strategy this strategy i've been using it and the levels that i was using was not good but with these levels trust me you're going to make money out of it so if you have not subscribed to my youtube channel you just subscribe is official numero at um, youtube and my channel on you uh, telegram is synthetic death uh, we do it um, all kinds of synthetic uh, indices and then we have forex currency as well we trade on gold and bitcoin that are sometimes i shared signals over there so on the comment section you can comment how useful this strategy have been for you and i'll sort it out if there is anything i have to add just tell me on the comment section or just join just look at the description under the under the video i've posted my telegram channel that you can give me a hi over there then we sort things out thank you for watching and have a very nice day